back and as promised in our previous video, we're going to show you how to build those $6 bar stools. Now at the end of today's video, we're going to have a cut list and a material list for you to pause the video and write down everything that you need. It's going to be a really simple and fun project. We hope you enjoy what we have for you today. So to build this bar stool, you're going to cut 15 inches out of your 2 by 10 for the seat. You're going to have four legs they are going to be 2 by 3s and you're going to cut those to 28 inches and each end is going to have an 8 degree cut going in the same direction. Once you have your legs cut, you're gonna lay them out so each pair forms an A, and you're gonna put two Craig jig holes at the top of each leg. That's how you're gonna attach the legs to the seat. To make sure that your bar stool doesn't wobble, you need to make sure that the legs are evenly spaced. We did a one inch measurement off of the long side and a three quarter inch measurement off of the short side. Okay, we're gonna install this together, just like Bob Ross. No mistakes, just happy accidents. So I made an accident. <laughs> a happy accident. A happy accident. But we fixed it, so it's no big deal. We're gonna make sure that we stay inside these crosshairs so that it's nice and even, and then we're gonna use our speed square to make sure everything is straight. So we have all of the legs attached to our stool. Now you see here, we are going to add some additional supports between here at the top, also at the bottom. So we need to measure across to see our distance and then make four cuts for top and bottom of each leg. So you put down your wood glue along the center between the two legs and then you grab your connector piece and put that right in the center there. Now we're gonna connect this with a screw. You want to drill about halfway through the board length. And then you can just use a wood screw or an all-purpose screw to screw that directly into the seat. We're going to do that at the top of the chair and in between the two legs down here for some added support. So now we're ready for the final support piece on the bottom. It's going to go 10 inches up from the bottom of the lake and you're going to have it nice and parallel to the ground. So that's a wrap. I'm about to eat some ice cream. And here are the final <laughs> shots. This test right here is all that matters. Is it sturdy? <laughs>